Welcome to Bespoke Diaries, today's article is on, when it comes to recent trends in learning, nothing has gained as much traction as coding has, by Mohammed Amin, co-founder, CEO, ABC Coders, India. When it comes to recent trends in learning, nothing has gained as much traction as coding has. The starting age to learn coding is now lower than ever before. But what about those who teach coding? Well, they have been getting younger too, as evidenced by the story of young Muhammad Amin who is all 12 years old. He began his own coding academy a couple of years back with help from his father and has since taught hundreds of kids on how to code. This Korchi based youngster is truly an ace when it comes to coding. How did this yen for coding begin? Actually, his tryst with coding began when he was just 8 years old. He was given a block programming coding task at his school and upon completing it, he was very pleased. That's how he began learning to code for fun and soon became an expert at it. Amin began taking lessons for children when he turned 10 and since then, he started ABC Coders, with the guidance of my dad, says young Amin, when asked about the start of his journey in coding. How does it work? There is a lot of flexibility when it comes to our coding lessons online. We take the classes via Google Meet so that it is easy to access for both, the coding tutor as well as the student. In addition to that, our tutors come from all over the world which allows our students to be from all over the world as well. The timings are fixed as per the learner's interests. The students come from a very wide range of ages right from age 6 to even 20 years old. We also have a variety of languages in which the lessons are taken, replies Amin about the diversity of learners and tutors accommodated here at ABC Coders. Speaking about the interests of the students, Amin adds most students that join ABC Coders want to get into coding to understand video games. They would have played a lot of games in their childhood, so they are intrigued about how they are made. The teaching profession really runs in the family since both of Amin's parents teach at their own alternative schools online. But Amin was one who did not require much teaching by someone else to become an ace coder. His mother Rebina says, coding is a part of the syllabus at our institute, hashtag future school. But Amin took it up a notch higher by self-learning advanced concepts, even robotics and artificial intelligence. He would refer to the internet for this and would try rewriting existing codes. He even built our website for ABC coders from scratch on his own. Rebinu also talks about how coding builds a sense of productivity among children. Children join coding classes out of their own interest and hence do not waste time at all in other activities like watching videos all day. They get to build games according to their liking. This boosts their creativity, she opined. A real aspect that causes students to come for more while coding is that it is output-oriented. Amin's father Shihab Udheen Park says, Whatever idea we have in our mind, it can be put into effect by coding and the result can be achieved in real time. This excites the learners. Furthermore, we function on a reverse engineering model. We show the output first which piques the interest of the learner. They then break apart the system and try to rebuild the output from the theory that they have learned. This is unlike conventional learning where a lot of theory is fed but with no end in sight. We have designed the curriculum on the basis of how to gain the attention of a young learner. We based it on Amin himself to reach out to people his age. Thank you for your time. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Do leave your thoughts in the comments section below. For similar type of article please reach us at contact at thebespokediaries.com or you can visit our website www.thebespokediaries.com.